So we came out here to record, man, and a whole bunch of people surrounding me right now, looking at me with the camera. But I'm alright, these people are here, people are here, man. Hey, how you doing? You okay? She's, she's camera ready. Hold on, let me do it again. Tell them to subscribe to your channel. Nah, Mr. Fresho ain't trying to show me around, though. You ain't trying to show me around. You're telling me I got to wait one hour. Here is in Kenya, Nairobi, pipeline area. Ah. Things are very cheap. You are crowded. So when you go back to your country, say hi to them. This area. People are single. People are single. People are single. Yeah. All the women here are single? Yeah. So all the women here are single? Yeah, the women here are single. All right, guys. So... From what you can see where we're at, um, we are heading to a place called Pipeline, King of Pipeline Estate, which is one of the most densely populated neighborhoods in, uh, in Kenya. This is, this is still part of Nairobi County. Um, unfortunately, I had a tour guide, but the tour guide is actually out of town, and I'm supposed to meet someone here, but they're kind of procrastinating and not answering my calls. Um, so I decided, I was at Garden State Mall and I decided, you know what, it's a Saturday, it's a beautiful day, the sun is out, it was raining all day, then the sun came out, so I decided, you know what, let's go out here on our own. If the person makes it, they make it, if not, we get it. Because here, team check, we don't wait for people, we go out and do it ourselves. So right now we're going to go check out the pipeline, I'll let you guys know where it is. If you're new to me and I'm new to you, make sure you subscribe to the channel. Join Team Check because we call ourselves Check Chase because we're chasing that bag. You already know. I rode Dolo from state to state. Ah, okay. So right here, guys, what you see is part of the pipeline. But uh, from the location where we're at, we actually have to go around. So that's why. I, now, if I was just crossing straight over, I'd be here, but we have to go around. Oh, nice. That's kind right there. Guys, look how this place looks. Man. Super populated. Densely populated. Hey, hey. Guys, you can see how populated this place is. How busy the streets are. So many vendors. Yo! So many vendors, so many people. Man. So. Uh, reading up on this place, I was told that it's not dangerous. So I'm saying to myself, oh, I'm good. This is not a dangerous place. I'm, uh, you know, I brought my bigger camera also. And um, the driver just told me, because uh, I actually read this online. And the driver said that uh, they're saying it's not dangerous in the states where people live. But the actual area, like the marketplace and all that can be dangerous. Which that kind of makes sense because anywhere you go in the world where they have marketplace, it, it's probably, you know, it could be dangerous. So, and I'm not planning to record the states, so meaning where people, where people live. So, uh, we're going to see, man. We're going to just uh, get off and, and, and take the chance, I guess. Take the risk. I think I'm okay. I think I'm okay. But it would have been nice to have a tour guide. Hopefully nothing happens because David just told me that the states is us the states is safe but not this this area so all right david wish me luck david yeah, all right. <laughs> man look at this place right here man the only thing that's good is there's so much people here and it's so busy people are not paying attention but you know until you're recording but check this out like up there, 
you can see uh you can see they're using um they're using like uh plastic so when it rains the clothes will still get the clothes won't get wet it's crazy oh man i don't know where to start sheesh Wow, this is a busy street. Hey, hey, what's up, boy? My goodness. So, um, just to let you guys know, the uh, people living in these one-bedroom apartments, depending on location, the one-bedroom apartments could go anywhere between 4,000. Look at this. Y'all saw that? But see, I don't deal with street food no more, so I'm not uh, dealing with that. But the, the apartments go anywhere between 4,000, 4,000 and 5,000 for a one bedroom. But if you're in a nicer area, uh, like if you're in a, or, or a bigger apartments and houses go for between five and 11,000. So 5,000 is like, uh, I think 5,000 is like 30, $35, something like that, $35, $40. So these people here are paying between $35 and uh, $80 bucks a month. What's up, boss? I don't know where I'm going. I'm just going. Hey. Hello sister. How you doing? Hello. So I actually got a tour guide and the first tour guide that I had is actually not here. She's out of town. And the second tour guide said they're gonna, they might come and they're not responding to their calls. Normally, I know when you deal with people and they don't respond to their calls, most likely they're not gonna show up. So I decide to just come out here solo. Remember the slogan, I rode dolo from state to state. I rode solo from state to state. So here we are. Hello. Damn, look at that pork right there. Wow. So I want to ask some people about this area, but there's so many people moving around, it's kind of hard to try to stop somebody and ask questions, because everybody's just moving around. What's up, boss?
But in order to do that, we got to get away from the music because that music is so loud that it's hard to find someone who can tell us about the area. Oh my God. It just keeps going and going. I don't know when it stops. They got alleyways. What's in this alleyway? So the problem is, uh, this area is so populated that you got people just drying clothes everywhere. And um, also, when it rains, the floor gets it's, it's, it's the floor gets pretty muddy and because it's densely populated and they got a lot of mud so like these little corners where you go around corners it's very muddy in the corners so i don't want to hit a lot of these corners because i'm not trying to get like my shoes all muddy now if i had on some like rain boots it would be perfect Hati. Damn man, it's 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 really hard to try to find somebody like ask questions because everybody's just kind of constantly like moving and busy. And even if you go to like even if you go to like a uh, uh, vendor and if it's they're selling clothes and it's something you really don't want, it's kind of tough to ask people. But I think if I don't find anyone, I might just ask a vendor uh, for something interesting about the area. Guys, the setup in these little hallways are like crazy. It's like little hallways where they have like electronic shops, beauty salons, and uh, barber shops. It's like you gotta go through a little hallway. And up top, I think further up top they got like bars and stuff. But look at these muddy, muddy, muddy uh, floor. Look what you gotta go through. Look at this. Just look at how muddy the floor is right there. See that? See that? So, as you can see how muddy that floor is, there's no way I'm gonna go through that way. There's no, absolutely no way I'm going that way. So all these are like uh, repair shops, salons, barber shops. Further up, they got bars. Go like further up here, like if you go up here, it'll be a bar, right? And they actually got people who stay up here too. So let's go further down. This lady just pushed me out the way. This lady just pushed me out the way, oh shit. See, people watching the games right here. It's a barber shop, everybody's watching the game. Phone repair shop. Salon. Everything. I was walking through this way and the lady just pushed me out the way. If a woman pushed me out the way, if a man pushed me out the way, it's one thing. But when a woman does it, that means she must be somebody important. <laughs>
fruits, veggies. Maybe she knows something. Ah. That's a lost cause. Guys, I'm here with a local uh, a local guy here and he actually has a YouTube channel. Wait fast. Wait, you don't wanna get wait wait no. for what? Show me uh, my channel? Yeah. He actually has a channel so uh, I'm gonna give him a quick little shout out. It, but he has to give, for, on, in return, he has to tell me something about the area. If he tells me something about the area, I give him a shout out. This is me right here. But you know the area, no? Uh, I'm just coming to see. This is me right here. I, yeah. yeah, so I'm a subscriber. Yeah, check an effect for you. See, I do travel, see? This is, uh, this is Kambu. Yeah. And this is, uh, this is, uh, Nanyuki. This is uh, Nanuki right here. But uh, if you don't know, if you don't know, you, but do you, don't, you don't know nothing about this area? Oh shit. No, no, I know nothing about this area. I've just come to shoot. I'm shooting? Yeah, I'm just shooting down there. Let's go. Let's go, bro. I go with you. Come on. All right, I got a content creator out here that's shooting. So we gonna, I'm going to go ahead and and, uh, and see what he's shooting. And I might as well come out here. See, this is, this is Nanuki. Nanuki. This is Nanyuki. Nanyuki. But, but my parents going to take almost one hour. Huh? So you, will you wait for one hour? My parents one hour? One hour. Oh man, I can't wait one hour, man. This guy want me to wait one hour. I can't. Oh, you got the lady, that's why. Uh, nah. Nah, I wasn't recording, man. Yeah, yeah. Huh? You think you know me? What's my name? Hey, this guy said he already know me. Yeah. Check the fact. Probably. I'm everywhere, bro. But you know this area. If you know this area, tell me something. Because I'm supposed to have a tour guide that come with me, and the tour guide couldn't make it. So I wanted to ask somebody something about this area so they can, you know, tell the people. So like, what's, what's, um, for example, what is it, is this area considered dangerous or not? Is this area considered dangerous? Sorry? Is this area considered dangerous? And what's the cost of living here? Like these apartments, how much do they cost? Like these apartments over here? Internet. It's okay, bro. Uh, now you're pulling out. You're pulling out. You want to record? All right, let's do it. So there's a what? What you say? I'm telling you that when I try to, when I try to see uh, so we came out here to record, man, and a whole bunch of people surrounding me right now, looking at me with the camera. But I'm alright, these people are here, people are here, man. Oh, you, you, got, you do content? Let me see your channel. I don't have data. Do you have data? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I give you high spot. I'm a same AJ. I'm a same AJ. I'm a same AJ. You don't need a Swahili. You don't need a Swahili. Dogo, okay, Dogo. A little bit, a little bit. I'm, I'm in Kambu. Yeah, I'm going to give you data. Which Just country? You are from which country? Uh, United States. United? Yeah, United States. I'm going to give you some data right quick. Right here. 
iPhone. iPhone. Yeah, look it up. So I can see your channel. All y'all got a channel? All y'all got channels? Yeah. Uh, this guy. This guy. This guy has a channel, and I'm and I'm here recording, but he's telling me I gotta wait an hour. I'm not. I don't wait an hour, man. I don't wait, bro. I'm like, I got some. I got somebody that was supposed to come and show me around, but even now. I say I left, I left. I'm not gonna wait. Because when you wait for people, it gets dark. So what, what do you want to ask us now? I'm asking right now. Okay, let, let me let me open the Wi-Fi first. Let me open the Wi-Fi. It's iPhone. Okay, I'm gonna turn this off. Turn this off. Hey, how you doing? You okay? She's, she's camera ready. Hold on, let me do it again. Click on. What, you got a channel? Tell them to subscribe to your channel. Subscribe to Mr. Fresh. Nah, Mr. Fresh ain't trying to show me around, though. You ain't trying to show me around. You telling me I gotta wait one hour. I'm missing your channel. No, it's not a channel. It's a, it's a iPhone. iPhone. Turn it off. Turn it back on. I'm gonna turn mine off. Turn it off. It's called iPhone. Hold on, I didn't ask the question yet. I didn't ask the question yet. So I'm gonna ask her a question right now. Tell me something about this area that people don't know. Or well, something interesting about this area. Oh, some things are very cheap here. Oh, so people come here to, to shop for cheap products? Yeah, here is yeah, in Kenya, Nairobi, Pipeline area. Ah. Things are very cheap, people are crowded. So when you go back to our country, say hi to them. And don't forget to subscribe to our channel, Mama is official. But the area is so congested. Yeah, the area is so congested. And uh, even schools here, yeah, they, they pay cheap. Is it, is, it, is it dangerous here? Yeah. Is it dangerous here? Sorry? Is it dangerous here? Dangerous. What's that? Dangerous. Dangerous. Yes, it's dangerous. Danger, danger, yeah, yeah. danger. <laughs> I want a camera. Like, how can I get it? Yeah, yeah, buy it. You got a score. Yeah, it's very dangerous. How much? You got a camera like mine. You got to go to the store and buy it. How much? Uh, this is maybe uh, $50. Dollars. 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 That's in Kenya. Whoa, this, this video is not about my camera. This video is about the area. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, so let's yeah, not talk yeah. about my camera. Uh, like, we, we got, I'm trying to find out about the area, not my camera. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So tell me, what else is interesting about this area? People are single. People are single. People are single. Yeah. Are single. Yeah. Yeah. So all the women here are single? People are yeah. So all the women here are single? <laughs> yeah, the women here. Yeah. <laughs> so any women I see, most of the women out here are single? Yeah, yeah, we're single mothers. Uh, what, what's the main tribe here? Is it Kukui? What's the yeah, main tribe? Yeah, it's the Misha, the Misha. Kisi. Kisi? They have a Kisi and Kamba. Oh, so it's Kamba. 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 And what are you? I'm a Kisi. Are oh, you a Kisi? Yeah. You speak Kisi? Yeah. Say something in Kisi. Thank you, More. Actually, actually say, say, say something that the people should know in Swahili. In Swahili. Yeah. So I, I say in also in I, I say in Kisi, then I translate to yeah, Swahili. Yeah. Something that Okay. Then I see that uh, 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 no, 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 I'm saying Yeah, I'm saying Say that in 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 Swahili. Yeah. What does it mean? How I see all people of Mount Kenya. Ah, okay, yes. okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. Where, are the, where are the deputy president comes from? Oh, yeah. And then, another thing here, this is the There is no slams. No slams. No slams? No slams? Yeah, no slams. Ah, so this is how it is, what you see, yeah, what you get. And we have tall buildings in pipeline. You, you. In Kulika. Yeah, I see. It's tall buildings. We have tall buildings in, in this so area. What is this for? What are you doing this here? This is a stand. I have a camera. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I have a camera. 
Let me see your camera. Where your camera at? That camera costs more than this. And you asking about mine? That camera costs more than this. No, this that camera. That camera costs more than this. Oh yeah, that's more. Very small. You see? Let's exchange. That no, this is more. This is more. No, no, this is this is it's called Canon and I like you. No, this is more. No, it's cause it's cause uh, like um like um no it's cause like uh, maybe two hundred and no it's cause like no three twenty US dollars. Ah, so yeah. this is more. This is more than this. No, this is more. But even though this is smaller, this is more. A little bit, not that much. Not that rich, maybe yeah. like thirty dollars more. Yeah, that's good. That's it. But the, the so lens, more. the lens is expensive though. Yeah. The lens. Yeah, because. Alright, guys. So I'm gonna hey, I'm gonna head out. Give a shout out to your channel while I leave. Yes, guys, please subscribe to our G TV show, uh, YouTube your channel. channel. What's your channel about? It's all about. Um, okay. Yeah, my my channel is all about. Uh, no, it's all about life. Life yeah. channel, yeah, lifestyle, life, lifestyle. Uh, lifestyle channel. What's your channel about? What's your channel about? Thank you, thank you for coming. She loves right. the channel. Right. 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 All right. Yes. Thank you. Oh, thank you. So we are done now. Good. No, no, I'm not done. I gotta record some more, brother. I, gotta, I just can't record at night. Guys, what I find what I find so crazy is that this small little road right here, and all these people going, and there's big trucks coming through. Like with all these people walking, there's big trucks and look at these trucks right here, trying to come through and, and, and go through the people and it's so small. The, the road is so small and it's like people trying to fit through the little small roads, it's crazy. Look at this. See that? That's insane. It's like you can barely fit through here, so. You know what, let me exit to the to the, one of these corners. Look, look how tight fit it is. This is crazy. These guys were cool, but what what the only thing I didn't like, they was more concerned about trying to uh, trying to um, grow their channel instead of uh, actually using using my platform to show people that you know talk to the people and people see you find you interested. There was more concern about just growing their channel, which I, I get it. But you know, if I get on somebody's channel, man, first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to answer all questions about a place that I'm at, and then give a shout out. So therefore, people know. You know that I'm here for business, that I'm like, you know, trying to help if somebody else want to come out. Wow, damn. This shit is crazy. My goodness. My brother. I guess I can get some pineapples, my brother. Yeah. You get a pineapple. Pineapple, then yeah, it's, it's sweet. Very sweet. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Where you get the pineapple from? From UG. You huh? Yeah. Where you get the pineapple from? I get. They are from UG, Uganda. Oh, Uganda, there you go. But I get them in Marikiti. Ah, okay. Thank you, my brother. Okay, I'm gonna get. I'm gonna get. Yeah. I'm gonna get uh, just one. You keep the keep the other. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, so hey, let me ask you a question. If, if this camera right here, if I want to go down there uh, and record, um, I'm okay, or or people gonna have a problem? Right, 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 it's dangerous. Right. They're gonna try to steal it. It is okay when you, can, I, uh, you hold it like that. Like this. I'm yeah. okay. Right. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. So nothing's gonna happen. Thank you, my brother. Look at that. 
somebody wanna don't have a TV and you wanna come out and watch a video uh, football, they got it right here. Now, I don't know if I'm supposed to record that spot because that might be a gambling spot. So people, you know, if it's gambling, they might not want it being exposed like that. So I just record a little bit of it and I kept on moving just in case. Everything for sale is over here, man. Jesus. From shoes to locks to extension cords to fruits, veggies, everything. thing I can say is this is some really good pineapple it's like every time I chew a piece it's like so much juice is falling out pineapple juice mm. shit look at this area right here my goodness Damn, good pineapple. Let me show you guys this area right here. Look at this piece of land right here. Man. Looks like this is where everybody come and dump their trash. As you can see. Everywhere you go, there's clothing on the... It's like, damn, there's always clothes in the clothing lines. But I guess because it's been raining, that's another reason why you see me with the sweaters because it's been overcast. It's been raining and it got kind of chilly, so I have on this and then the sun came out, it warmed up. And now the sun is going down, so it's getting back chilly again. Guys, let me ask you a question. Can you imagine living here, waking up in the morning or waking up during the day and your apartment is right there and this is like every day, this traffic right here is every day, just to call an Uber, just to get down, you gotta go through this all the time. Look at these. See that? These are actual people that live here. Like, and this is every day. You know what I'm saying? This is like every day. So just imagine the, the, the hassle of every day coming through here, recording, not recording, but coming through here and uh, you know, you gotta go through all this just to get out your house. Like what I do when I gotta call an Uber, Uber has to come through all this heavy traffic. Just to get in an Uber, you gotta go through all this. Man. But I tell you one thing, they have everything here. You don't even need to, you don't even need to, to uh, go anywhere. You want gas, they got it. They got fruits, they got it. They got, you want food, they got it. They got appliances, they got it. Everything's in one stop. It's like you never have to leave this area. And like, if it was an Uber coming, this is what an Uber would have to go through, just to pick you up. Another thing about the Kenyan people, I give them credit because a lot of Kenyans speak three languages. Most Kenyans speak three languages. Swahili, which is the national language, um, then they speak their own tribe language. So, for example, if they're Kikui, they're going to speak Kikui. If they're Loa, they're going to speak Loa. If they're Kisi, they're going to speak Kisi. Plus, they speak English. So, most Kenyans most Kenya speak three languages. Most. But, if not, if not three, the majority, the majority speak two, which is Swahili and English. Um, but people who are not educated, 
and you know who don't go to school and all that they probably they don't, they don't speak english the, the ones who are not educated some of one some of the ones who are not educated don't even speak swahili just their own tribe language <laughs> Clothes, everywhere you go is closed. Yep. Everywhere you go is closed, closed, closed. When I see people and they and when I see people, I acknowledge them and I keep the camera up. Because people here are like lions, they sense fear. So I'm not, God damn, look at this. Sheesh. What's up, bro? You're good. Good, good. Salsa. Hey. Hey, baby. so I can't really record. Thank you. So I was out here getting me a haircut and um, now it's a little dark so I gotta try to figure out a way to get out of here. Unfortunately, they were playing rap music and with the YouTube copyrights, I already know that I won't be able to uh, use the clip, but um, we'll see if it works out. So the haircut in this neighborhood, I paid, uh, I think I paid $2 for a haircut. And they give you a haircut, trim your beard. Also they shampoo your head and all that. I paid, it's equivalent to two US dollars, if I'm not mistaken. I, uh, I gave him a thousand, got back eight. So I paid like 200 and some change, 250. So it was like two bucks. I need to figure out a way to get the hell out of here. Hold on, come on. Hold on, come
Thank <laughs> you.